And joining us today is pop singer and songwriter Georgia Lapalitano. Georgia is one of the rising stars of the dynamic U21, that stands for under 21, music scene which is growing in Austin. Georgia has been singing since age six and is now a high school senior. It is her dream to become a famous singer and this is a place to get started for that and help with the less fortunate children of the world. This year she was chosen as the Austin Idol and also won the prestigious Youth Cast Contest presented by the Austin School of Performing Arts. This past Sunday she emceed and performed the second Youth Cast Competition where she handed over her winning cup to a new young star. Georgia is currently presenting her first studio EP entitled And So She Sang produced by Grammy Award winner John Hudson in London. She has performed the national anthem at Fenway Park. That's a baseball stadium in Boston for you Aggies out there. Uh, <laughs> appeared in Blender and OK Magazines and has participated with charities uh, with her music. She recently started her own charity, Texas for Autism. Please welcome Georgia Napolitano.
Excellent. Now, Georgia, you get to promote yourself a little bit and tell us where we can see you perform and where we can buy your music and tell us about your website if you have one. Okay. Um, my website is actually my name.com, so georgianapolitano.com. Um, I just got my CD printed, so I'm really excited about that, but it's not quite yet on iTunes and CD Baby, but we're getting there. So if you'd like to hear some of my original music, it's on my website, georgianapolitano.com, and it also shows you where I'm going to be performing and stuff like that. Um, I'd like to say thank you first to um, my guitar player, Zach Hennig. He's a part of my band, so if All you right. can put your hands together for him. Thank you. And... Um, and then, yeah, so um, I have a gig coming up on Saturday downtown at the Paradise, which is on 6th Street, and it's from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m., so if you can make it in that time slot, I would love to see you there. And, um, yeah, I'm just, you know, doing stuff and keeping up with Teens for Autism, which is a lot of fun. Um, helping children with autism has been such an inspiration, so I'm really, really happy to be able to do that. Best of luck to you. Thank you so much Thank for you. your work and with charity. And we do have a proclamation for you to read. And it reads as follows. Be it known that whereas the city of Austin is blessed with many creative musicians whose talent extends to virtually every musical genre, and whereas our music scene thrives because Austin audiences support good music produced by legends, our local favorites, and newcomers alike, and whereas we are pleased to showcase and support our local artists, now therefore, I, Lee Leffingwell, Mayor of the Live Music Capital of the World, do hereby proclaim November 19, 2009, as Georgia Napolitano Day in Austin, Texas. Thank you. <laughs> And I'd like to welcome Carol de Cardenas, who has been such an amazing support to me and is the founder of ASPVA. And without her, a lot of what I have done wouldn't be possible. So this is Carol. Thank you. You're welcome. Love you. Love you too. Um, thank you so much for honoring Georgia Napolitano in this way. It's, it's a big deal for a 17-year-old to have a day named after her. I am the founder of the Austin School for the Performing and Visual Arts, and YouthCast is a new Austin tradition. Um, we host this event at the Long Center, and we'll be hosting another event in, in May. And the, the event was created to launch our mission for the Austin School for the Performing and Visual Arts, and that is to support students like Georgia Napolitano and our newest winners, Clue, an amazing singing and, and dance act that won at the Long Center last Sunday. We're very proud of them. And that cup will be passed to them. We expect for this cup to be around 150 years. So we add each name for the winners of YouthCast. And so we expect to fill this cup with those names. Um, we are very excited to make downtown Austin home for the Austin School for the Performing and Visual Arts. We just landed a spot at 1110 Guadalupe Street, and we are now open in an we are now open for enrollment for 6th through 12th grade for fall 2010, and you can expect to see us around town. We get invited on numerous occasions to support the next generation of Austin artists, so thank you.